You want to tell us a little bit about the dream or are you keeping it quiet for now? We have actually shared it on a leaf on the tree here behind us. Uh, and the dream is uh, the cliche to change the world. Change the world through changing ourselves. Make this world a better place. Not through talks to government or... But when suffers from us and then extends to our family, our neighbor, son, then take care wherever. Okay. So thank you. And uh, I'll give the floor to our two colleagues, George and Angelos. So hello, George. Thank you for coming here. I will be your facilitator for this session. So let's quickly draw an invisible curtain between us and the audience to get concentrated on what you have to say today to us. Let's uh, discuss at this moment what you would like to, um, what is your primary concern? What you, would you like to discuss with me today? My concern, I guess, is that I see poverty and anguish around me, both in my country and uh, everywhere else in Europe, in the world, I might say. So I ponder, what can I do? If I see the television, I see all the News don't help much. I expect politicians to do something they won't do. Uh, they cannot do it or no. So what can I do? I sense you, you, want, you, you have a lot of burden on your shoulders. What, what, how do you feel? Where does this put you? Not much possibly right in the middle because either way, I have to make a, a decision. And my decision is if others cannot do something about uh, the problems, uh, then it lies uh, at least to me uh, to do something. And uh, I'm pretty certain that in, uh, in a way there's something I can do. Uh, I want you to help me find out what is this, just to try to understand what can I do. Well, let's say, for example, if you had all the resources you could have, um, and pe- uh, material and human resources that you could uh, gather, how do you plan to act? What would you, how could, could you construct your environment? So, from what, uh, what comes from the discussion is that if I can get all the resources I need, if I be possibly managed to get through this uh, limitation of mine, which is not having everything I need or everything other people need, what if I just say what I have? What if I just give some of my time to people who need it? What if I help? Is this the way? Yes, I think that could be a way. How do you plan to go with this? Right away, I can just start right now. I can just go outside and give something I have to somebody that needs it. I can plan my time so if some time available for us. So I think this is quite mine. And that's what I will do. I'll just sell my time and sell my resources. And hopefully somebody else will do the same. And hopefully somebody else will do the same. So at the end of the day, change has happened. Yes. It's up to me. It's up to us. Great. Thank you. It could be your dream. Yes, thank you. Thank you. So, as you see in this uh, session we had, we'd like you to engage, uh, be engaged uh, during breaks, as uh, Marina said previously. And we will hand out uh, to you in the breaks um, some instructions, but let's briefly 
explain through this, yes? Okay, so as you see, we are, will be running in pairs. One will be, uh, have the role of the facilitator and the other one will have the role of the dreamer. And we will try to get the best we can from uh, the other person, right? Okay. So as a dreamer, the audience will just uh, split in pairs. You form not all pairs outside in breaks, in every single break. And as a dreamer, if one becomes a dreamer out of you, and everyone should become a dreamer in an in exchange, you're supposed to find a way uh, to get the dream that was lying inside you for so long and uh, let it surface. And the facilitator on the side will just try to do the same for you, okay? Just get it out of you. But the whole point is that if you dream as big as you want, as big as you can, and you don't put any limitations in your dreams. And the point is that when you are out of this uh, dream session, say, live your dream, we call it, you find out that you have a robust dream that can be put on paper, we have a tree outside called the tree of life. A tree of life at the moment has no life because it's empty, there are no leaves. So your point is that your dream should be written in a, a leaf, we have leaves outside for you, and you just stick it up on the on the tree of life, and so it comes alive. So the facilitator... Yes, just remember just that as a facilitator, you should support uh, every little thing, every thought that the dreamer has, and you would... It's uh, very crucial that you would like that you would uh, strive to construct with him to help him construct the big dream he has. You have to base this relation this uh, on this session on confidentiality and trust and respect, of course. So uh, the dreamer can start off dreaming and uh, uh, build a, a bigger dream every time that will uh, take place uh, in the session. Okay. And so, at the second session, the last break, you are supposed to run this, uh, again, this uh, Live Your Dream uh, exercise. And the third uh, session, the, la the, th the last break, uh, there, should, there will be a camera around you. And so, once you have decided what your dream is, look for the camera and explain how you felt about the exercise, how you felt is very important, how you felt inspired about this exercise, and what your actual dream was. Okay? Yes. <laughs> yes, you will be. So, just keep... Be black and fat. Okay? Thank you very much. Thank you. All right.